All right, guys. So we get ready to pull up over here at the uh, at the bank. Um, I already know what's up, man. Uh, just ready to. I'm really ready to get down here and get this bike, man. I want to check it out, man. I'm nervous, man. This is my first time going to be on a super sport bike like this. It's a like I said, it's a 2017 750 Jixxer. So, man, I couldn't tell you how many videos I've watched. Um, I've been watching a lot of my man's channel, uh, Straight 805 Speed. If y'all don't know who he is, he's from California. Uh, dude's a great dude, man. He's, I think he, I, I think his current bike's a 750. I'm pretty sure it is. Oh yeah, by the way, if you're trying to finance a bike, bro, good luck, bro, because that dog on insurance, bro, is insane, bro. If you can't buy the bike cash and just run liability on the bike, because I mean, if you wreck it, bro, I mean, Bikes don't cost as much as cars to put back together, bro. I'm just gonna be straight. It don't cost as much, um, obviously, but even still, if you can have full coverage on your bike, get it, because you, I'm pretty sure so there's some things in there that cover you as a person, or if you have to go to the hospital type of stuff, but yeah, just be open-minded, you know what I'm saying? Um, be open-minded about it. Um, if you can do it, do it. If not, I get it. Personally, they told me on a 750. Well, no, no. I ran a 600 RR with my with my insurance the other day, and it was going to increase like my my bill for insurance alone, and the bike payment would have been like 500 and some dollars. I'm like, uh, yeah, nope, not doing that. I uh, can't afford that at all. So I had a personal loan already opened up with the bank. So I just told them, bro, you know what? If y'all will uh, spot me this loan now, to see now with the bank, what you got to understand is is that. They don't, most banks aren't trying to give people that kind of loan, like a, like a, for a motorcycle loan, you know? So I had to qualify it as a personal loan, um, and then I'm just gonna take the money and do whatever I want to with it. Um, and I'm pretty sure I, I'm not pretty sure I mentioned to them that I was doing some, getting some work done in my house and stuff, which is I am. But we're getting ready to pull up here at the bank. This Joe guy in front of me here. Make shift that dog on the combo with that flatbed on the back of it. It's pretty nice. It's made out of wood. Pulling up to the bank. You already know what it is, man. We're gonna go in here. Get this bread. I think I just need to get the cashier's check. I still don't know nothing about that yet, but evidently that's what I was told to get, so that's what we're coming up in here for. I'm trying to grab this parking spot right here in the front of the building. Right beside the heavy cap so. Alright guys, we're gonna walk in sec two and get the employees credit union. We're gonna see what what's happening. Uh, we'll come back out and we'll uh you know this is what it is. <laughs> we're gonna get this thing man. We're gonna we're gonna see what's up man. I'm just nervous today man. Um really excited. Um I was gonna record with you guys on the freaking uh Nikon here but I need a mount or something in the car. I need to get me a GoPro, uh, but my phone here does, I got an iPhone 12 Pro Max and it does 4K 60 uh, on it. So I figured the 4K 60 on this ain't gonna be no different than me doing 4K 60 on a GoPro, you know? So um, the only difference is I want the GoPro so it'll mount on my helmet or something so I can do some uh, vlogging with you guys on the motorcycle. Um, but, you know, uh, I'll catch you guys back out here in a minute, man. We just, all right guys, so we just left the bank. Everything turned out fine. We got the money, we got a cashier's check. I'm pulling out the bank now. I never come this way, but this is just the wildest thing, bro. I've never seen so many dogs in one place, bro. Bro, this is crazy. Bro, they got dogs all over the place, bro. I mean, all over the place. I mean, it's a gate full of dogs, bro. Like, I mean, bro. A hundred dogs easy up in here, bro. Like, just gates full of dogs. I've never seen this, bro. I mean, like, what in the world? I mean, this got to be a dog on a daycare kennel for... I don't know, bro. They got to be some rich people in Dog in America, bro. That's crazy. These jokers dog got dogs out here at the yin-yang, bro. What are you talking about? Y'all just got dogs, bruh. 
These men, these people got dogs. I'm gonna get my shades on, man, because the sun's coming out. It's a little shiny. Put these shades on right here. My bad boy shades, you feeling me? Take this right turn so I can go where I'm going. Like I'm going the right way. Oh, man, what a day. What a day. Yeah, boy. I thank God for the day, man. It's a, it's a beautiful day, y'all. I'm still a little nervous. I'm ready to go get this dog on bike, though. I'm ready to go get that bike, though. I think I'm gonna take a right here. I really believe I'm gonna take a right turn. Hey, guys, hold on a second, man. I gotta look this up on uh, Google Maps. All right, guys, so I got it worked out. I had to make sure I was on the right street that connected over to this other street because we got to go to Lowe's Hardware now and get a um, the ball joint to go on the back of the truck so I can haul a trailer. And then we got to go to U-Haul and pick up the trailer. So I thought I was going to have time to go back home after I got the ball joint, but the judging by the time, I think I might just have to go get it. thought I'd have time to get back, but based on every, how the time of everything's playing out, I'm just going to have to go get it and then head back to the house. I hope I'm on the right road, because this ain't the road that I thought I was supposed to be on. But yeah, we out here chilling, man. It's nice out here in North Carolina now. Y'all got to come out here and see, see your brother, man. You got to link up on the bikes or something, man. We got to get together. It's a beautiful day. Now, it is supposed to be a little chilly today, though. That's the only thing about today. It's supposed to be a little chilly. A little cold today, y'all. I love this truck, man. This daggum Silverado is amazing. Oh, yeah. I don't think I showed y'all my truck, man. We get out up here at the uh, Lowe's Hardware. I'll, uh, I'll show you guys the truck a little bit. I ain't never been on this road before. This must be a little back road. I just moved up to this uh, area in December, so I'm still kind of learning some of these back roads and stuff up here. But, well, thankfully we got phones that have GPS and can do all that stuff because otherwise I'd probably be lost too. See, I don't even know where I'm at. This ain't even where I'm supposed to be at, man. I don't even know what road this is or where it's connected me to. Oh, wait, yes, I do. I know exactly where I'm at. Taking a right turn. I know exactly where I'm at. I just didn't know where that road was going to bring me out at. But I figured it out now. That makes sense. That's actually a lot quicker than me. Probably. This is probably a lot quicker than me coming down uh, Highway 127 over here. Let me turn my heat down a little bit, man. It's getting a little toasty. I wish I had somebody that could have came with me. Uh, my wife and my well, my daughter and my wife, they was knocked out in the bed, so I wasn't going to bother getting her up and all that stuff. It just, it's easier for them to sleep in. Yeah, Boom! If y'all didn't see that, there's a speed bump on the road. There's another one up here, too. I guess it's because it's a school zone. They're trying to make sure you really slow down, bro. They want you to slow down so bad that you actually have to stop at that thing. I don't like shoot, bro. I got a lifted truck. We finna the dog on plow this speed bump. I'm gonna make that speed bump look like a chump. <laughs> I'm gonna make that speed bump look like a chump. You feel me? Hey, gonna look at this dog on side by side trying to turn. I should have turned right there. Why am I turning right here for? Red Classic. Come on, Red Classic. Come on, bro. Come on, big dog. Move out the way. I tell you what, I'm thankful for transfer trucks, bro. They be giving me my Amazon packages fast sometimes. You know what I'm saying? Bust the right turn, right chin. Too bad I'm banking first to horizon. Shoot, I've been right here in front of Lowe's Food. Lowe's Hardware, excuse me. Lowe's Foods. Let's see here. I need to find a decent little spot to park at. 
Lowe's hardware is always packed because people are always trying to build something. You feel me? Ah, I busted in here. Tried to get good. Let's back up real quick. Make sure we straighten up a little bit. Just because it's North Carolina and people get a little, you know, antsy. <laughs> you feel me? All right. All right, so we parallel park. We feel good. We look good. Kick that off. I don't know if I got to have a mask on. I don't like having a mask on, but I guess we're going to take a mask in just so nobody says nothing about that. Don't really want to have it on, like I said, but, you know, people. People, people, you feel me? People's people. People do people things. You feel me? I'm going to show you all the truck, though. Um... Yeah, I mean, she looks dirty, but you can see the truck. 2016, 1500 Silverado. I got the windows tinted. But, uh, yeah, we're going to Lowe's. I'll catch y'all in a minute. All right, guys, we just came out of Lowe's Hardware. Uh, about to go put this dog on thing on here so I can carry the, uh, the trailer down there to Charlotte. Like I said, it's about an hour away. It should do just fine. 6,000 pound capacity. Alright, guys, we're gonna get this thing put on real quick. I'll be right back, guys, with you. Alright, guys, she installed. We're gonna get ready to get out of here, man. You gotta get on. I'm going up in here. Oh, the Jays. Jays on my feet. You seen the Jays, baby? You see them? Yo, what's up, guys? So, we got the bike. Uh, I'm headed home. You can kind of see it back there a little bit. Um, I was going to do like a little bit of a review video while I was there, maybe, but there was like four or five of us. If I'd have had my helmet on and had a GoPro, probably would have did it while I did a little test drive on it. Um, bike checks out as far as gears smooth bike uh everything felt good the only thing that i'm not used to is the steering uh i think it's a steering damper um is what i believe it's called and um it's something that i i guess i just gotta learn uh, i i don't think i have that on my current bike on the 300 and so i think on this bike it's something i gotta learn to like uh do because when i was trying to lean the bike to like 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 you know if you're coming to a curve and you lean into the curve you're leaning you know and the bike will you know you lean into the curve and the bike hugs the hugs the ground and you know or the tires grip the ground and you take the curve well on this bike it wants to give like a little bit of a uh a not resistance but it, it's like the front wheel actually wants to turn into the curve which i'm not so sure i'm opposed to yet i gotta figure that out i think it's just a muscle memory thing that i gotta learn and uh, i'll have it down but other than that it's a great bike feels good looks great um there's a few cosmetic stuff that i want to remove uh he's got like this little padding going up the gas tank from the center crotch area and i just don't i don't know it looks like it's been on there for a while and it's kind of peeling and stuff i'm assuming that he put that on there early on uh when he got the bike um bike only has 1500 miles on it uh he wasn't lying about that at all um so I got, I got a lot of life left in the bike to drive on it and, you know, have it and check it out and love on it. You know what I mean? Um, but it's dope. Uh, it's a dope bike. I'm not really a particular person that likes the color blue so much. Um, I don't really like the color blue a whole lot, but a motorcycle with blue on it, I mean, it's going to be noticeable. It's, you know, it is a little flashy. Um, I do plan on maybe getting some different fairings for it at some point down the road. Um... But overall, all in all, seems, seems like a good bike. Uh, my dumb tail, I gotta do, gotta, uh, I didn't check the lights on it, so I'm gonna assume that all the lights work and stuff. Uh, it's just daytime. And he, and he installed some LEDs on it though, but I assume if the LEDs work, well, the headlights and everything else is gonna work. And it'd be funny that the LEDs that he hooked up to the bike didn't work and those other lights did, so I don't know, but. Um, I'm, I'm happy. I'm really excited. I, I really want I mean, it's a little chilly today. I'm probably going to end up getting home practicing on it a little bit. Um, 
he did give me a phone mount to go on it. I do have a phone mount now, something that I didn't think I'd want to have or, or get to have, but he has a phone mount on it, so I got the phone mount. We're going to be chilling. We're going to get it in, and we're going to enjoy the bike. Uh, I'm going to try to get some cool pictures with the bike. I got my Nikon sitting here ready to rock and roll, so um, hopefully, uh, hopefully we can get some good pictures, man, um, and, uh, you know, just have some fun on the motorcycle and get used to it, you know what I mean? Um, but, guys, this... You know what it is, man. It's 828 NC Speed, baby. I appreciate you guys. We're going to keep it going. We're going to keep building the channel. I appreciate you guys checking in with me. And uh, thank you for the few subscribers that we got. I look to try to keep uploading some videos for you guys. Um, I'm going to have to try to have this edited and done. Um, and try to get on to the next video. Get me some GoPro cameras so I can do some vlogging while I'm riding. Uh, talking and whatnot, you know. Um, I'm really looking forward to it, man. I, I, vlog it seems like it's really fun. Um, a lot of people seem to like that. Seem it seems like a lot of people like to do it, um, and uh, I'm really I'm really interested and hyped about you know trying to get that 100k subscribers um, and seeing what happens, man. And, you know, just trying to show some love for North Carolina, man. Um, you know, I, I, mean, I can't say I'm sure there's people that do this down here and vlog and stuff, but I don't know who they are or where they're from or nothing. So. I'm going to start doing it myself, and, uh, you know, uh, people around me are probably going to find out and know about it and whatnot, and, you know, it's just something different. I've been into video gaming a lot and streaming video gaming, but um, it just doesn't seem like that's something that's really taking me anywhere, so I'm just kind of switching up the, you know, switching up what I'm doing on the entertainment side and seeing what I can do, you know, uh, but I hope you guys like the video. hope you guys enjoy it um, as I'm on my way home now. Um, so I've been driving for about hour and a half going on two hours got a little bit of a ways to go um but i appreciate you guys and i appreciate y'all's time thank you for watching the video and guys we'll catch you on the next one hopefully it'll be on uh riding the the G the jigsaw i gotta start saying that the jigsaw the 17 jux the 750 yeah it is a 750 by the way so i'll catch you guys on the flip side 828 north carolina speed baby we out